We're in Clearwater Beach, Florida. I've never been shark fishing in my life. I can hear the drag going from here. This sounds like a good fish. We're out here. It's ah. a nice fish, Jordan. Yeah. Yesterday, I killed some hogs. Today, we're sharking. I'm Jolly B. Wiles. We're showing you how to do Florida. You cannot put this lever, the top of it, to the bottom of this. It has to be right in line with okay. it. Okay. Like to the T. It's so important. Gotcha. Because it's too loose, you're not going to hook them too tight, you're going to break them. Gotcha. So this is it. This yeah. is the spot. Yeah. And then when he takes it, he takes it. Yeah. There's no, I'm yeah. not setting it we'll, like a YouTube we'll, bass so, fisherman, So it's right? going to be here. Okay. It's going to be right there. Okay. And then, so when, when this gets eight, let's say I'm nowhere to be found, yeah. okay? When this gets eight, this, you push the button in. Okay. And then, and then put it, it down. Uh-huh. And then now it's in free spool. So now it's less tension. He, he can't feel us at all. Right. And then you let him do his thing about like 30, 40 seconds. Right there. And then reel. Okay. That's it. He'll be on. We got this Megalodon on the way. So we're using bricks to catch these sharks. No, I'm just kidding. Bricks are gonna hold the bait down so that the, the bait doesn't move around with the current. It stays in one spot. That way when the, shir the sharks are circling around, they smell the bait. It's easier for them to find. It's easier for them to grab that hook. And it's easier for me to yank them in here. Tell me about your uh, shark drama there. He told me he was gonna go to the right and he went super far left. So now we gotta move our rods. But it's all good, we'll still get them. Nick went over to ask them, hey, don't throw your bait over here. We've already set up. And they were like, yeah, we're gonna do that, whatever. And then they did exactly what they said they weren't gonna do. This is the 50 wide reel. This is the one that Jordan caught his 10 foot tiger shark on. If you want to watch that video, I suggest you go watch it. It's awesome. But we're going to catch the 11 foot. Real feel like the Yeah. And go as loose as possible. All right, so Nick is taking the stingray out. He's gonna drop it probably what 400 yards out and uh, it's a little choppy but we got the GoPro on him we're gonna see just how uh, how he handles this stuff and and yeah we're gonna reel in a big one the birds are going blitz mode Woo, roller Woo see you stingray How do you feel about that drop? Perfect, right where I wanted it. All right, Nick's dropping the third rod out. I changed out of my uh, Chad's shirt. Shout out Chad's. If you don't know Chad's, go to chads.com. Check out the cool hats, patriotic wear, keep America free, all that good stuff. Um, but he's taking out that third bait and he's pretty confident that it's gonna hit like within 20 minutes of dropping. I don't know if you can hear me. The wind might be bad, but we are caught in a storm. It's lightning. It's been some We're going to set this up. And hopefully, maybe there'll be some. Josh is back in the truck. We're out here. Nick and I stayed out here. We're surviving. Storm, someone's got to watch these rods. Someone's got to be man enough to stay out here and do it. Oh, they're out. oh my God. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. We got it. Uh, I'm not sure, but it's running. It's running hard. All right, take this. Pull back. I got to get this one. All right, remember, All right. top of this, right here, right below, right below. And honestly, I would set it in the rod holder. So I would come on top of it, okay, flip it up, 
and just crank down on it and it'll start screaming. Let me know I'll, when. I'll tell you when, I'll tell you. Right. That's the one tiger. That's another tiger. Can you record on the fence? Let's leave it there. I'll tell you. It's a big day. We're going to let him do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, no, no, no. Just come right next to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, I'll be right there. 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 Alright, I'll He didn't like that. Yeah. You're good. If he's pulling, you're good. Right now, it's like a walking game. So, like, if you think you can pull him back a little, uh -huh. just walk back. You need to put this down. That would hit? Yeah, he's pulled. Hold. I think we're good. Walk left. Walk left. Keep walking left and I'm moving. Y'all probably can't see me right now, but it was raining really bad, so we had to put all the cameras in the truck. And so now Josh is on. We got the GoPro on him out there. I got the camera. I'm getting the light on. We're headed back out. I can hear the drag going from here. It sounds like a good fish. We're on, baby. We're on. Hold. You still on? We out here, Josh. We out here. <laughs> it's a nice. How we doing? Tired. My left arm. We just had to get everything untangled. We had it tangled up with that other rod. Chaos, man. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What you thinking, Nick? Look at it. Look, look. It's going. It's a giant. It's a giant. Dude. <laughs> Is it hurting your your waist? Are you good? No, it's not hurting my waist. It's just trying to get the, it's trying to get the leverage to spin this reel. Gotcha. So a good trick that I do yeah. is walk back about 15 feet. Uh huh. Set it. Stay in the tight. Sand. No, just stay tight. Keep walking back. Like you're gonna just try to pull them. What's that dragon? Just keep walking back. Hopefully that's not like structure. And then when you're ready, you're just gonna walk forward and reel, but you have to stay somewhat tight. Not crazy tight, but you just gotta stay tight. And just gain as much line as you can. There you go. Work him, Josh. I'm gonna pop this clipper off for you. This is your PB shark. This is my PB shark. Biggest one ever. I feel like it got tired quick because it's not pulling drag as much. Does it know you're there? <laughs> I don't know, that's a good question. It knew I was there when you were going to get that camera. <laughs> that's for sure. Give us an update, Josh. Yeah, so we got hammered with a storm and we came out here to check. Yeah, it's there, it knows I'm there. And uh, not, not even 10 minutes standing out here, all of a sudden we hear some drag pulling. And now we're on it. Woo. I tell you what, this ain't nothing like bass fishing. <laughs> A little different here. Uh, definitely ain't nothing like those monster brim I caught in a few episodes back <laughs> when y'all were trying to catch that koi. <laughs> if y'all ain't seen that video, y'all need to go check it out. I can see where that uh that belt pole or whatever would be. Yeah, I liked it, man. That was the Cadillac. Yeah. See 
pulling or he's pulling? Put that on me, okay? Well, while uh, Josh is uh, laying back on this shark here, we all, we're all kind of thinking it's a tiger, right, Nick? Yeah. Tiger. We just caught a big tiger the other night, but go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. And if you want to come out here and come shark fishing with us, 500 likes on this video will bring one of y'all with us. Come on, Josh. Only if Josh lands this fish. It's right here where it don't want to go nowhere. I've been fighting this thing for what, 30 minutes, 20 minutes? Yeah. yeah, 30. 30 minutes, and it just broke off. Now, I don't know nothing about what I was catching, but the guys with me, they're like, that's a heavy fish. Unfortunately, we'll never know.